And one thing, one thing I've learned very early in life, okay, especially the, the age I am, when you accomplish something, there's never a you, okay? There's a we. Mm. There's a we, okay? That's and right. that's what I'm trying to say. That's right. Some of the greatest moments I look at, I had people around me that we did it, you know? Right. Yeah. For, and I think everybody has a calling in life. You know, some people disregard that calling to go make money, you know? We, myself and you, could do have done anything in our world, you know, different, you know? But we chose to do this. But I never, when I woke up, there might be some mornings I like to sleep a little longer. Yeah. But I never, dre- yeah, I never dreaded to go to see, right. to work with a teenager or, or teach or something. I, I enjoy it. I, and I remember we used to have a job description and at the end we put W-I-T, whatever it takes. And, and sometimes you cannot, everybody has to work for a boss. So if that boss asks you, you know, I remember, uh, you know, at Huntsville State Park, depends on the day of the week, and I learned a lot. There were some days I was a janitor, some days I was a garbage man, and there were some days I was a ranger. You know, every, those days you were a ranger was pretty good, but you had to do all this other stuff to be a ranger, you know. But uh, but you have to, you cannot say no to job. You know, you might not, you might not be in the right place you want to be, but if you keep working, and looking for what you want to do, as long as you're working, the other opportunity will happen. I really believe. I think, uh, and you know, people ask me all the time, even at church, what's the difference between a teenager in 1979 yeah. and, and 2016, 2017? I said, a teenager's been a teenager. Parent, the family life has changed. And I think as you adjust, you realize that you have to become, I think the hardest deal is like, you, you have to be that person's, you know, father or yeah. you know, or something, and 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 you want to be too, but you you and sometimes you 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 do all you have you can do. The most challenging thing is you can't do enough sometimes, mm-hmm. and I think that's that's what I heard sometimes. Like you cannot do enough, you know. I, I want to do more. You know, and, and that was the toughest challenge at all. You know? And this, this story still touched me, but this, when the first year in Knox, and uh, this is before Oak Ridge was built, and you had that community, you know, Tamina and mm-hmm. all that. Mm-hmm. But I get to school early and I hear these kids, you know, and this is after football season, so there was no morning practice. And, and they're there, and I, I went back there, and they're taking showers. And, uh, and then now they hear, I come from a family, we didn't have a lot of money, but we always had running water and stuff like that. And I go back to this coach, you don't understand, this is the only place we can take a shower, hot shower, you know, or shower, you know. So I made sure that I was there every morning, made sure that field house or it was the, open. open so I can take a shower. Yeah. If they were willing to get up early to go, make sure that they were going to take a shower, I got to get up early to make sure that they're okay. That door is open. And, and I think. <clears throat> and college don't teach you that. No, no, no. No. You don't get that theory no. in the books. You don't no. get that. 